picked up a safe. Only problem is you got to get it out of here. Get the strap around it. Winch it out. Yeah, it's you know, like someone's got a good deal on a hell of a brick. Well, yeah, why not? Good luck moving it. <laughs> <laughs> so. I'm like, what? I'm like, nobody else is gonna buy it. I'm like, oh, good heck. I guess nobody else is gonna buy it. I'll buy it. <laughs> We've got change of the truck, grip hoist, and all the way over. Let's see what happens. Hope the damn thing ain't bold again somewhere. I did. Did it? Oh, it's moving. Yeah. Hold on. Maybe you just lift up on that pry bar. Okay. No, no. No, we're taking the whole bench. Uh, something. Well, we can push the bench back. Hold on. I think it's just a thing. It actually sits down about an eighth of an inch. So we can actually pick it up. Get it on top of it. There we go. Now we'll just hold up. Let me put this back up here. Something going to get your shit. Oh, that's something. And I screwed it all up. Yeah. What do you think would be better? Get the Somewhere you've done this before. <laughs> as long as you're doing options, you're, you're gonna find stuff that you can't live without. blocks now. I think it's heavy. Mm. I might have just wasted money on that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I wasted money on that.
So I was able to use my high lift pallet jack as you saw to lift it up and then just winch it into the bed. But uh, I guess I could change it to something kind of try to pull it back out. We're going to use my engine hoist. See when we pick it up. It's way heavier than I thought it would be. Obviously, I need a strap going each way. I can only do one at the moment because I got to lift it up high enough to slide a strap under, but we'll be fine. Time to do some sketchy stuff. That is a lot of weight. This thing's way heavier than it looks, like way heavier. Okay, we're floating. I think the best thing for me to do is to pull out and lower it to a, a safe height. Okay, I don't know if you guys can hear this. Neighbor's been driving by for a couple weeks now with this rod knot in this board. Check this out. I hope the camera picked up how loud that is. Keeps going. Kid, where's my ice cream cone? It's like 20 degrees outside. You're eating an ice cream cone when it's 20 degrees? Yeah. Heck yeah. Okay, I don't care what temperature it is. I ice cream whenever I want. We're gonna see how much it weighs. I have no idea. When I first saw this online, by the size, I thought, you know, safe that big. They're way heavier than you think. I'm like, 400 pounds. Started playing and moving around. I'm like, no, it's at least 800. And then after I got it in the truck, I'm like, no, I think this is 1,200 pounds. So that's my guess, 12 to 1,300 pounds. So we're going to see I bought a crane scale just for this, just because I'm so curious. I'm always moving heavy stuff, so it'll come in handy. But let's see what it weighs. And I can't see it now. So what does it weigh? That's 1,550 pounds in that little cube. That's heavy. That's very heavy. No wonder the truck was squatting. So this is roughly a 75 year old safe. It was actually used in a local business. And then the guy took it home, he passed. Uh, I do not have the combination, but it's still in the works that I could get it. However, it is open, so you can take out the back plate and you can figure out the combination pretty easy. Not a, not a big deal. Just don't close it until you figure out the combination. Um, inside here, you actually have one compartment and then a second compartment. And I'll show you, and there's a second door. So back there, I'll show you out here, there's a second door. Looks like this, and there's two keys. Um, actually, no, it goes like this. So you'd actually insert one key, you'd have to turn it, pull it out, you take the other key, you put it in, and then it'll allow you to unlock it and open it up. And that's for, um, there's actually two little slots to put cash and coins. So you'd open the main door, then in here, you see up on top, that's for coin rolls, and that's for cash into that back chamber, and here's a little hinged door to hold on to that little plate and that locks back there so 
That back one is roughly 10 inches deep. This little front chamber where I guess you'd put the money you were going to use for the day or something. So maybe the owner would come in, he'd grab out his wads of cash, stack some here for the tellers and stuff like that. So when he was gone, I don't know. And then you, anything you don't want touched, you put in the very back. And maybe you give one key to a manager and one key to your, you know, I don't know, your armored truck guy that picks it up. Anyway, that is the entire safe. You can see the outline right here. This square is a 10 by 10 cube. That is all this safe is. This shocked me. So then you're wondering, well, it's an old safe. It's, worth, it's worthless. So that's the entire thing. It's worthless. Down here is a plate, and that just accesses a huge bolt. Well, it should. We can take it off and show you. So right now, I think I'm going to cut it up. If you guys want to see a video on that, I'm going to cut it up, and I think I'm just going to save this middle portion. It's still a decent little size cubby in there, you know, a little 10 by 10 cube. You can still put a, quite a bit of stuff in there. If I just cut out that center cube, um, I think they actually called it the... Uh, they, do, they did actually just sell that center section, this Mosler Safe Company. Um, but I think that's worth more by itself being, you know, 150, 200 pounds. 100 pounds probably. 100, no, probably 200 pounds. Um, then the entire thing by itself is worthless because nobody wants to move it for something that doesn't even hold, you know, guns or, or whatever they want. But let's remove this bottom plate and, and see what's in there. plate is this a big old bolt or oh yeah this is the part that you would I guess cement into the floor and here is our huge bolt it was actually falling out when I was doing it and now I can actually see all the cement so yeah this is all the cement giant block of cement is all I have here huh Interesting, right? I bought a block of cement. It was cheap. It was super cheap, so. Can we see how much you weigh? Let's turn the scale. Let's drop it down. Here. Hey, come here. Get the strap. Do this. There, there. Let's put it through you. Day. One. Okay. This is fun. This is gonna be fun. No, no, no. It's not dangerous. I swear. Two. Hold on. Three. No, no, no. You're gonna love it. I swear. It's gonna be fun in the end. You're gonna be grateful you let me do this. Okay. Okay. We won't do that.